this is a poem I, I wrote um, when I when I went on on holiday with with my young wife and kids, and we um, we hired a uh, a camper van. It was a sort of VW camper van. It was uh, what's described as a pop top. Um, in other words, the the top sort of pops up, and so you can get two kids on the top. And we were sleeping downstairs on this uh, on this steel plate, which wasn't really very comfortable, but it was it was okay. We had a lovely time. The weather was beautiful, and I got to see bits of Devon, which I've never really explored uh, Devon before, and uh, so this was really rather lovely. Um, but the and of course I'm I'm very interested in architecture, so we had a look we had a look at all the sort of Totnes Castle and all those sort of places. And uh, but the the journey, the, the place we picked up the camper van and the place where we obviously we had to return it to was a uh, was a town, the old capital of Cornwall, which is called Launceston. And so uh, the po this poem, which is about my trip to Launceston, uh, has the name Launceston. Standing on top of Launceston Castle in Cornwall, I waved down to my kids, who were standing at the base of the castle. I wonder, what do they think of me? Do they think, that's the nicest man on earth? Do they feel great waves of warmth? Or do they think, that's just Dad wandering around old ruins, being boring about architecture? Perhaps they think, I hate that man. How convenient it would be if he fell down the castle steps and landed in a sticky pile by the outer bailey. If he fell, my friends would feel sorry for me. I would get lots of presents, and I'd have a new dad, preferably with a bit more money and a better sense of humour. Whatever their thoughts, they keep them to themselves. But stare up through the castle railings, wave their comics at me and smile.